Hi guys, welcome to my kitchen. Today we're making pressure cooker Mississippi chicken. Alright, I'm starting out on my pressure cooker. I have three boneless skinless chicken breast. I'm going to add in a cup of water. And I'm using my McCormick's Himalayan pink salt, black pepper, and garlic seasoning. If you don't have that little salt, pepper, little garlic powder, or granulated garlic, I'm just sprinkling, sprinkling this over top of the chicken. I have one onion. This is a small onion I diced up. That's going to go in. And this is going to be a quick, easy, and delicious Sunday dinner. Hey guys, I want to mention real quick, today's me and Holly's 29th wedding anniversary. Can't believe it's 29 years already today. I'm going to lock my lid on here make sure we're set on seal. Alright, I'm going to turn this on. And we're going to set this to pressure cook for... 12 minutes and guys I don't use this machine too often so please excuse me after the 12 minutes are up I'm going to do a quick release of the pressure all right my chicken's done I took it out and set it aside I'm going to shred it up now I'm going to add another cup of water in here and I've just set on saute sear saute and it's getting hot I'm going to whisk in a pack of au jus gravy mix. Guys, if you can buy store brand, I'm using Walmart brand. Do that because that'll save you money of the name brands. And I'm going to whisk in a pack of ranch salad dressing mix. Gonna give us that good Mississippi flavor. It's just like Mississippi pot roast, but we're doing it with chicken. And we're making a gravy for over the chicken, and I'm also making some mashed potatoes. I have a cornstarch slurry here. It's about three teaspoons of cornstarch, about two teaspoons of water. We're gonna get that in there. That's gonna help thicken up our gravy as this comes up to the boil. Let me give that a stir. And lastly, I'm going to add in some pepper and sini peppers. That will give it the good Mississippi pot roast flavor. This is a 12 and a half ounce jar. I'm going to add about half of it in there. And while I shred my chicken, I'm going to allow my gravy to thicken up and allow these pepper and sini peppers to heat through. one more in there. All right, I'm going to go ahead and shred my chicken up. All right, guys, I added my chicken back in. My gravy thickened. This is ready to go. Let's go ahead and fix up a plate and see what we got. I also went ahead and made some red skin mashed potatoes to go with this for that gravy and some green beans. Let me start with this chicken. Moist, tender. That gravy that it warmed up and is really delicious. Try some of this gravy on the potatoes here, guys. It's really delicious, well seasoned. And if you want your gravy a little thicker, just put a little more cornstarch slurry in there. Guys, that's really easy, really delicious. No trouble at all. Pressure cooker Mississippi chicken. Thanks for watching and support me. And remember, love what you eat and eat what you love.